we met back in the old stand-up days, and I would, uh, she was obviously hilarious, and I'd see her act. There was a time they were developing a pilot for us as brother and sister. Yep. And uh, we had such charisma together. And then we did the improv in Dallas. She loves this. We did the improv in Dallas. She was the headliner. I was the middle, but I was still good. And, <laughs> and then I started to have like a crush on her. And I didn't know her well, but you were so funny. And then you invited me to the condo just to watch, because you had cable, which was nice. But I take that as flirting. And then we, you know what I mean? Because I'm a guy, and then our names are on the marquee together. I thought that was like romancy. You uh, didn't see that. Uh. I saw it that way. <laughs> and then we, on the plane home, you had a Walkman, so I thought you were rich. And I like that. Because <laughs> so I was looking for a, sort of a sugar mama at the time. Uh. And then, and then I told my friends I wanted to date you. I said, I like Ellen. And they're like, yeah. And I go, she's great. She's so funny. They're like, yes. And I go, she's so pretty. And they go, uh-huh. I go, why is no one jumping on this? I should date her. And then I got the news. Uh -huh. Yeah. Everyone knew but me. I don't know why. Uh -huh. I go, oh. <laughs> So we'll just stay friends. They go, yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. And we have stayed, and we've stayed good friends. Yeah. I love and it. And you're very funny, and I adore you. And I thought we would have been a good brother and sister. It's too bad that show didn't go. But I know. That was a fun but idea. But now you're a big, fancy movie star, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it worked out okay. <laughs> no, it worked out okay.